Yet another Metro building project is over budget. This time it's the new Bellevue Ice Center. News 4's Nancy Amond tells us what happened and who might wind up footing the bill. The final bills are coming in for the new Bellevue Ice Center. It's over budget, 900,000 over budget. Does all of that go towards construction? Today, members of the Sports Authority weren't happy about it. Tell me why it went over budget. The Sports Authority will run the facility. The Predators use it too. But Metro's General Services Department was in charge of building it. And today, the COO of the Predators said, hey, don't blame us, we never even saw the budget, never got regular updates. General Services based its estimates on what it cost to build the Ford Ice Center in Antioch. Problem is, that one is smaller. The Sports Authority's executive director proposes taking money from the Bridgestone Arena Fund to make up the $900,000 shortfall. Ticked off board members put off the vote until next month. It's understanding that we had some cash on hand, um, the thought was maybe this is an appropriate way to, um, to help everyone. This isn't the first project overseen by General Services that ended up needing an unexpected cash infusion. Remember a few months ago, same story with a new headquarters that General Services is building for the Sheriff's Department. Mayor John Cooper and some members of council were pretty hot about that. In fact, council legislation was introduced to help stop this kind of surprise cost increase. Nancy Ammons, News 4. We can tell you this, Predators CEO Michelle Kennedy gave us this statement this afternoon. It says, we are ecstatic about the facility and about our partnership with the Sports Authority. We are honored to have this phenomenal facility.